As gas prices near record highs, we hear from those in the transportation industry who are really feeling it the most. Thanks for joining us this evening. I'm Evan Forrester and gas prices are at a 14 year high and signs right now still point toward things getting worse. Fox 43's Alyssa Kratz talked with transportation companies about how it's affecting their bottom line. She joins us live in Lancaster with more on how it could also be affecting their customers. That's right, Evan. Right now, the average price for a gallon of gas in Pennsylvania is $4.24, but locally, we're seeing even higher. I mean, take a look here behind me. This Turkey Hill in Lancaster up to $4.39 right now. And for those in the transportation industry, we're talking charter buses, limousines. A lot of them have to depend on diesel, and those prices are even higher. These days, it's costing a lot more to fill up one of these charter buses. As oil prices soar to record highs, Bailey Coach has seen a 14% increase in fuel costs over the last several weeks. You know, obviously it's it's been affecting our bottom line. We're paying about $2,400 more for fuel that we, the same fuel that we were getting two and a half, you know, months ago at this time. Vice President and co-owner Courtney Piccolo says it couldn't come at a worse time as the company heads into its busiest season. April and May are actually our two busiest months of the entire year. So th those will be the months that we use the most amount of fuel. And most of the Bailey fleet run on diesel. The price is running the highest. It's nearing the point of having to implement a fuel surcharge for customers. We have only ever done this one or two times in the, the past 24 years that we've been around. So it's not something that we want to do, but it is something that if, if fuel levels get to or fuel prices get to a certain amount, it's something that we will have to look at doing. Lancaster based Superior VIP limousines is in the same boat. One of these here, you're looking about $55. Typically or right now? Uh, typically. So what, what is it right now? You can figure $15 more every time you fill it up. And now the company's owner says he has no choice. I haven't raised them for seven years. And now I'm getting to the point where I don't know if I'm going to raise the total price or out of fuel surcharge. Both businesses promising transparency, hoping their customers understand. I think that that's honestly the key is just letting them know, hey, this is what's going on. Obviously, if they're watching the news or just uh, anything, they, they know what's going on. If they're fueling their own vehicle, they understand. Now, according to AAA, Pennsylvania is actually one of the top 10 most expensive states to fuel up right now. And unfortunately for all of us, it doesn't seem like there's any relief coming anytime soon. Reporting live in Lancaster, Alyssa Kratz, Fox 43 News.